Hello, this is Valiant and Peak, and today I'm showing you some of the innovative uh, features and benefits of using the Sierra Design zipperless sleeping bags. We stock the complete range of uh, Sierra Design zipperless sleeping bags on our website, um, and I'm going to take you from one of the reasons, some of the reasons why we think uh, these are absolutely ideal. So a lot of people have moved towards quilts because they give plenty of room, they cut down on weight. Um, but what if you just prefer sleeping bags but you don't want the restriction of uh, a sleeping bag? Well, the, the zipperless sleeping bag range from Sierra Designs may be the thing that just fits uh, what you're looking for. This product in front of me is called the Backcountry Bed 20. So that basically is um, relating to the temperature rating in Fahrenheit. This product um, has a, uh, a limit of minus nine, but a comfort rating of minus three. Let's have a look at some of the, the features. I'm gonna turn over the uh, backcountry bed to start with. You'll see here a half sleeve which allows uh, a standard mat to go in and one of the reasons for that is is a it keeps it all together but secondly it removes unnecessary insulation at the bottom of sleeping bags which tend to at the end of the day just get crushed when you lie on that and you're relying on the insulation as you do with quilts insulation um, of your sleeping mat You'll also see this is really different in respect of uh, we've got almost like an integrated quilt in, in the body of the sleeping bag. Uh, it also has nice uh, hand pockets in there which is really good to snuggle down with particularly if you're a front sleeper or if you're rolling around um, that's great to, to, to just help you uh, keep that warmth in. That can be tucked in you have a couple of little uh, uh, toggles here just to hold that together so that actually just um, keeps everything snug and secure. And you have the mummy head as you would in a sleeping bag. Another excellent idea is the foot vent. So here you've got the foot box, your feet go in there, but actually you've got a an area here which you can stick your toes out if uh, if you're getting hot. That goes over there and so that when you're lying down you're not actually um, getting any sort of uh, air, cold air coming through because it overlaps substantially. This bag um, is filled with 700 fill power down and it weighs uh, 1.1 kilos. Um, slightly heavier than some sleeping bags, but look at the width you've got here. Look at the comfort you're going to have with a with a product like this. Uh, the shell is a 20 denier uh, nylon inside and out. So this is the uh, the, the uh, bloke's version of it. If you want um, a woman's one, my wife likes this colour a lot. She loves purple. Um, We've got the same in this purple colour, uh, exactly the same design. This is slightly heavier, around about 1.2 kilos. There's slightly more down in this because women tend to sleep um, a bit colder. But yeah, that's the backcountry bed. I really like this and I think if you're looking for real comfort um, when you're out in the wilds or even if you're in a, just a campsite or what have you, I don't think you go far wrong with that. The next one I have um, is uh, this product here. This is called the Cloud 800. I'm just going to move this out of the way. So we've got a bit more room here to show it. So just move that. And we'll start at the base. Again, we've got a um, a sleeve here to put the sleeping mat in. This one here is 
what they call the cloud 835, 35 degrees in Fahrenheit. So what does that relate in centigrade? Well, the uh, comfort rating is two degrees and the limit is minus three. This is a much lighter bag because it's got less down in it and to some extent you've got less features which means it weighs slightly less. So you've still got this zipperless format but it's just on one side and again exactly the same thing snug down you've got a hood there a little uh, cinch cord there to tighten around your, your head um, and again exactly the same um, feature here with the venting foot box. This is available in the two degree and also they've got out one which is the cloud 820 so again like the backcountry bed that will go down to minus three or minus nine is the absolute limit. So that's the uh, Cloud. I just wanted to say that actually there's an 800 fuel power down in here and the, um, the material is a 15 denier, so slightly lighter. So that weighs, this weighs in at 670 grams and uh, the other version, the heavier version, I think is around about just uh, around about a kilo. But great uh, products, a lot of innovation, a lot of comfort plenty of width in these to, to, to thrash about and to remain nice and warm if you don't want to go to a quilt and you've had enough of the restrictions with uh, sleeping bags. One other thing which you can do with all of these um, and could be nice particularly in the winter months just basically take one of our over quilts probably with a lightweight material maybe like a hundred or something like that and then what you can do is just uh, put that into the foot box and then uh, cover that over like that and then what you have um, is an extra layer of insulation to give you to go down lower but also being synthetic it will keep any of that uh, down from getting damp and will cover any of those particular cold spots that you sometimes see um, with, uh, with uh, baffles in sleeping bags. So that's another option that you can do and actually get best of both worlds. You get the real comfort in there and also you get the protection uh, from the synthetic bag. That's about everything now. If you want more information, go to our website, which is uh, valiantpeak.co.uk. Thank you.